All right, hi guys. So let's start the next episode of Five MCQ in Five Minute, in which we are actually discussing five important PYQs, which is going to be a potential MCQ also. This series is equally important for FMG, NEET, PG, and also for our INICT aspirant. Let's go and see what do we have for as a first question for the day. Inhalational anesthetic agent of choice for pediatric patients. So because of uh, you know least irritant and I would say more pleasant, sevoflurane is a preferred one, and about isoflurane, what we know it is going to be preferred. in a cardiac surgery because of their cardio protective property they are going to be preferred in the cardiac surgery and also they are going to be preferred in a patient with the neuro surgery neuro surgery cardio surgery mein isoflurane can be preferred halothane is something that is mainly associated with the maximum risk of hepatitis you know or i would say there is a word that they use known as your halothane hepatitis halothane hepatitis they can also be associated with many other problem like halothane can also be associated with malignant hyperthermia they can also be associated with malignant hyperthermia few important point that i wanted to squeeze on from this mcq we have taken already pediatric patient with sevoflurane will be the preferred one they are the less pungent and uh, no it's easily administered among which of the following statement is false about the given image now whenever you look at any image like this where you have to choose about potency and efficacy simply check out the potency i always say take help from the help mnemonic height will be telling you about the efficacy left wala will be telling you about the potency so if you are going to see left to right the potency order potency order will be going like a b c d a followed by b followed by c followed by d potency mainly deals with the drug lowest dose that can cause the effect efficacy on the other hand it's like eiffel tower eiffel tower is famous for its height no eiffel tower i always used to say eiffel tower kyun famous hai apne height ke liye efficacy eiffel tower so look at the height never look at the dose line in the efficacy so both of them are equally efficacious Yes. So we are having B is equally equally efficacious to see. Next in the order this is going to be your A. Next in the order is going to be your D. So drug D that we have here it is the least potent also. Drug D it's also least effective. Now let's read the option that we are having. B is more potent than C. Is uh, is it more potent than C? Yes. You have to find out a false statement. D is least potent. D is least potent. Yes. B is more efficacious than A. B is more efficacious than A. Yes. B का height जाता है. B is more efficacious than A. Next that we are having is A is most efficacious. A is not most efficacious. No. Efficacious में सबसे ज़्यादा efficacious. B is uh, equally efficacious to see. Right. Let's see the next one. Which of the following drug is represented by the shown image? Now in the shown image, if you are going to see this one, very simply you can see among the sympathomimetic drug, what we know the drug that can increase the blood pressure. and the drug that is decreasing the heart rate ek drug bp ko badha raha hai and the drug that can decrease the heart rate among the sympathomimetic drug a single drug that causes this kind of activity is known as your norepinephrine second thing i am going to tell you is the next question can be maximum increase in the heart rate this will be none other than your isoprenaline as a compound isoprenaline will be having maximum increase in the heart rate next question which of the following drug increases the systolic blood pressure increases systolic blood pressure but decreases the diastolic blood pressure increases systolic blood pressure decreases the diastolic blood pressure this will be none other than your again isoprenaline because isoprenaline is a beta 1 and beta 2 agonist because the beta 1 activity systolic blood pressure will increase and beta 2 activity will be causing vasodilation that will decrease the diastolic blood pressure if you are going to see here the blood pressure is increased but the heart rate is lesser no heart rate is lesser है ना ऊपर वाला बीपी का ग्राफ है नीचे वाला हार्ट रेट का तो ओनली ड्रग दैट इज हैविंग दिस काइंड ऑफ एक्टिविटी इज गोइंग टू बी नॉरेपिनेफ्रिन विच अमंग द फॉलोइंग करेक्टली डिस्क्राइब द डेल्स रिवर्सल फिनोमिना हाउ विल यू एलिसिट डेल्स रिवर्सल फिनोमिना इन प्रेजेंस ऑफ अल्फा ब्लॉकर इन प्रेजेंस ऑफ अल्फा ब्लॉकर वेन एवर अ हाई डोज ऑफ एपिनेफ्रीन इज गिवन वेन एवर देर इज एडमिनिस्ट्रेशन ऑफ द एपिनेफ्रीन द आउटकम दैट वी आर गोइंग टू सी इज ओनली फॉल इन द ब्लड प्रेशर राइट सो फॉल इन द ब्लड प्रेशर ऑफ ऑन गिविंग एपिनेफ्रीन इन अ पेशेंट प्रीटेटेड treated with the fentolamine this is how we are going to see because alone epinephrine it will have biphasic response alone epinephrine it will increase also later on it will decrease the blood pressure because alpha 1 being the uh, highest in number alpha 1 ke wajah se bp will increase later on beta 2 being the sensitive receptor beta 2 being the sensitive receptor the bp will decrease after that the drug is totally metabolized and the they will go back again to its normal 120 so normally epinephrine will be having biphasic response increase then decrease but if the patient is pre treated with the alpha block occur then there will be only fall in the blood pressure and this phenomena we call it is a dales reversal phenomena this uh, concept that we are having dales reversal phenomena we are very beautifully going to utilize them in our concept of uh, fuchromocytoma management 
विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग एजेंट डिक्रीज मोर्टालिटी इन पेशेंट विद क्रोनिक कंजस्टिव हार्ट फेलियर तो डिक्रीजिंग मोर्टालिटी अमंग द गिवन चॉइसेस इज गोइंग टू बी ओनली मेटोप्रोडॉल बिकॉज वट वी नो इज द बेस्ट इज गोइंग टू बी ए सीनिमीटर ऑल ऑफ दैम दे आर गोइंग टू बी एंडिंग विद द प्रिल ए आर बी देन एल्डोस्टेरॉन रिसेप्टर ब्लॉकर लाइक स्पायरिनोलेक्टॉन देन नेक्स्ट दैट वी आर हैविंग इज गोइंग टू बी आर्नी आर्नी इज ए कम्बिनेशन ऑफ ए आर बी दैट इज वल्सार्टान प्लस सेक्यूबिट्रिल वल्सार्टान प्लस सेक्यूबिट्रिल नेक्स्ट दैट वी आर हैविंग इज बीटा ब्लॉकर एंड वी आर ऑल्सो हैविंग एस जी एल टी टू इनिबिटर लाइक एम्पा ग्लिफ्लोजीन सो दीज आर द एजेंट्स दैट वी आर हैविंग मोर्टालिटी रिलेटेड बेनिफिट ऑल अदर एजेंट दैट द गिवन लिस्ट दे डू नॉट हैव एनी मोर्टालिटी रिलेटेड बेनिफिट राइट सो दिस वॉज योर फाइव इंपॉर्टेंट पी वाई क्यूज इन फाइव मिनट आई होप ऑल ऑफ यू गाइज हैव एंजॉयड दिस सेशन प्लीज डू नॉट फॉरगेट टू लाइक सब्सक्राइब एंड शेयर आई विल बी मेकिंग मोर सच कंटेंट फॉर ऑल ऑफ यू गाइज इन अपकमिंग डेज आई विल सी इन द अपकमिंग क्लास थैंक यू वेरी मच फॉर